Welcome to the how-to series on Dowsill Silicone Air Barrier System. This video will demonstrate how to roll apply Defend Air 200C air and weather barrier coating on a wall. At the end of this video, you will know how to prepare a flat wall before rolling and how to roll apply the air barrier to the wall. You will need the following supplies for this part of the system application. Defend Air 200C air and weather barrier coating. Dowsil 791 silicone weatherproofing sealant, spatula, hand or power roller, wet mill gauge. Let's get started. First, remove any bulk, latent dust from the substrate. For sheathing substrates, seal the seams of sheathing using Dowsil 791 silicone weatherproofing sealant, then strike flush. This is a similar process as mudding drywall seams. Screw heads that are flush with the surface do not need to be sealed. Screw heads that are sticking out or countersunk into the sheathing should be sealed using Dowsil 791 silicone weatherproofing sealant. On concrete or block substrates, patching may be required to achieve an appropriate substrate for coating. Allow any concrete patching to dry for at least 10 days before applying Defend Air. For more information on concrete substrates, visit www.buildabetterbarrier.com. Now you are ready to apply the Defend Air 200C air and weather barrier coating. Open the Defend Air pail. If any separation of material has occurred, or you see a slight liquid layer on the surface, stir the material to entrain the liquid back into the Defend Air. Using a brush or roller, Apply a liberal coat of Defend Air 200C air and weather barrier coating to all hard to get at areas and around all penetrations. Once you have completed all of the cut in work, apply at least a 15 mil wet coat of Defend Air 200C air and weather barrier coating using a roller over the entire wall surface, including any pre treated areas. Wait approximately 5 minutes before measuring the thickness using a wet mill gauge. This allows for the coating to saturate the substrate and allows you to measure the material on the surface. Wait at least 4 hours before applying a second 15 mil coat of Defend Air in the same manner. This second coat is needed to achieve the required minimum of 30 wet mills or 15 dry mills of Defend Air. Measure your wet mill thickness frequently to ensure proper coverage. When finished rolling, Clean the power roller, hoses, and hand tools with water according to the manufacturer's guidelines to prevent material from drying in the equipment or on the tools. Thank you for taking the time to learn about Dowsil Silicone Air Barrier System. You should now be able to apply Defend Air to a flat wall using a roller. Please see our other videos for additional application information on the Dowsil Silicone Air Barrier System. Visit buildabetterbarrier.com for a copy of our application guide and for more information.